So the morning of, it was easy peasy. Like, just got up, showered. I didn't want to not wear makeup because it is Dr. B. But, you know, <laughs> I'm going into, I just woke up and went to the hospital two hours before the surgery and, you know, just waited for the nurses to come in and do their thing. Um, I wasn't nervous at all. I'm just not a nervous person when it comes to really anything. Eric was in the room with me when Dr. Bergdorf came in and did his markings and so forth. And he's, Eric's, and Dr. Bergdorf reiterated, okay, so we just want to go like a, a B, a small C. And Eric's in the background going literally right behind him, no, 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 make it like a bigger C, close to a D. And I was like, don't you dare. Because again, that's not, I want natural. Um, so that was it. And then the anesthesiologist came in, gave me, asked a couple questions. And then they came in and, I don't know, started with some meds. And I remember being rolled out into the um, hallway. And that's all I remember. Nothing. And then when I woke up, I felt great. I had no pain, no nothing. I was a little groggy. But um, it, was, it was fine. I didn't have any issues. And I was only, I think the surgery took like a half an hour. He told me, he's like, it'll be 30 minutes. I, my surgery was at nine, I think. I was home by 10 a.m. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, it was really, really fast. And the recovery was no big deal. What I was a little bit weirded out about was, and he, he warned me, he's like, they're gonna be high. And I said, I don't want them to be high. He goes, well, they're gonna be high. In reality, they weren't, but you know what was that kind of led me to think that they were, was the padding that they had me underneath um, when I went home and I couldn't take it off for a couple days. Um, but then when I did, I was like, oh, look at that. So I, I didn't have any issues going home. I didn't have, I didn't have any issues even two to three weeks afterwards. I had a follow-up appointment three weeks later, um, and in between, his nurse gave me her cell phone number to call or text her if anything was weird. And I did have something a little bit weird. It was, um, it just felt like there was a rolling, hard, um, like cord just under here, and it was tender. And she explained to me, oh yeah, that's, that's actually normal. It, your body is transitioning and moving some things around. Um, just massage it a little bit and I followed her advice. And by the time I went back to see Dr. Bergdorf for my first follow-up, um, all of the stitches had already dissolved except for one. And I don't know how he saw it, but he did. And he plucked it out and told me, you know, continue to massage. and. Um, then we talked about, okay, now what can I do with my face? 